Yo, 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 it's your boy in Squiddle, and today I'm going to be talking about college and my thoughts on it, right? So, I personally think you shouldn't go to college at all, right? So, a college, all to me, bro, is a certificate, bro. I would not hire anyone just because they have a college degree, bro. I know so many people that are lazy, and so many people got into college like that. Like, I myself, I think I'm like a high-performance worker, and I get everything done. I know so many people who are lazy who, like, procrastinate, sit on, don't do, whatever they have to do, and then are in college. You might just get A's and remember how to do information and put it down with a test. But what does it have to do with like actually putting in work and doing things every single day in and day out and like actually being smart with it? You wanna work smarter, not harder, right? So let's say you go into college, right? You're starting off, you get out four years later, you're in 100K debt. Most people, they buy a car they can't afford while they're already in debt, so they're paying. They take out another loan for the car and then they take out a mortgage for a house and bam, you're 100K in debt, you have a loan for a car, you have a mortgage for a house. It's like, you're, set, you're setting yourself up for failure like that at all, bro. All right, let's just take me for example, right? One year out of high school, I just performed so fucking well. I have all these things. I have like five people that are all in college right now, but they're all working for me. And like, I don't know, like everyone like in college that's making crazy moves or doing anything at all, bro. Every, most everyone that's in college, bro, they're all gonna be in debt or they're all broke as hell. Like to me, like college, bro, just cause you have like a certificate doesn't mean you're gonna put in more work or like most people, they, they go to college to get a fucking job, bro. You never want a job. You want to work for yourself and own your own business. And like, let me tell you first, bro, college isn't like, if you go to school for a business, bro, they don't teach you any skills of business at all. They're not gonna, like, it's so, it's really simple, bro. All I gotta do is look on, all the information is free on YouTube for everything, bro. You can literally learn anything. If you watch the right YouTubers and you don't, and you don't watch the people who talk about sports and like all this other stuff, right? You can learn so much, that and books. Like you can literally just like watch a step-by-step -step tutorial, how to set up the LLC, how to do this, how to do that, how to do taxes, how to do all these simple things. And then you take skills with, the business and like you, you don't really learn in my opinion through a book bro i learned through experience bro i know for a fact that 99.999 percent of people would have quit with all the problems that i've had so far it's literally about like having a problem solving it right away then going to the next problem the next problem i've already learned so many problems that i already know all the solutions to everything so when someone else were to start something i could just say oh do this step by step and you won't have my problem it's literally like you have youtubers that own businesses and like eight, nine figures, and they tell you how to do all this stuff. And you don't need like any, like I'm not hiring anyone based off a degree, bro. So personally me, bro, I would hire people off of, do you work out? Do you have a good diet? Is your sleep right? Are the people around you good? What are you doing on the week? Like if you're not all about like what you're doing, like your work should be your passion. It shouldn't be something you like, drag yourself to go to every day the environment's terrible you don't even like what you're doing you should enjoy every single day you should have a great routine you should do all these things to maximize your energy levels to go as hard as you can in them for that like amount of work dude you know how many people like uh it's per se they take like a lunch break and stuff right at work and that's like oh i can't wait for lunch break i take an hour lunch break do all that stuff dude when i had a job bro i would grind like 12 hours straight and i wouldn't take a lunch or a, they would like force you to and you would just like eat while working dude like nowadays with like everything i'm doing bro most of the time i wake up at like seven o'clock and before like last year bro, i wouldn't eat till like four o'clock i would grind the whole time and as i ate dinner bro i would work while eating i would just go go get like people that like don't know how to like just continue working and they try to find like a break and do all this other stuff no dude it comes down to like do things that give you energy while you work, such as going for a walk and doing all these other things. That refreshes your mind, bro. Like, so many people, they're just, like, lazy, dude. So, you know, my thoughts on college, bro. You're getting scammed going to a college, bro. Like, it's just, they're waste. Not only are you in debt, bro, there's four years of your life where you could have done something else with it. I think it's only personally if you were to go to a school that has good weather year-round. Other than that, like, I think it is not worth it at all and obviously if you get a full ride and you get to go somewhere and you get a net the whole thing with college row is networking but nowadays we have our phones you can network with anyone and every everyone right right so what i suggest doing is not getting peer pressure to go to college by every teacher in high school everyone around you be like oh what are you doing after school going no no no, no. that's not how it works at all um i highly suggest just 
getting a job, saving up your money, and then invest it in your own business or other things. And so you don't have to work for anyone. You have freedom by owning your own business, and you can go hard as you want on that. And then just go from there. That's like really, really simple. Especially nowadays, you got YouTube. You got all these platforms where you can just make videos and do whatever you want. If you have a passion about soccer, make videos about soccer. If you have a passion about race cars, make a video or make a page on Instagram about race cars, a TikTok, a YouTube, all about that. Even if you like dogs, make a dog page. If you like lawnscaping, then like take pictures. You can, you know what I mean? You can literally do anything. It literally has made the spectrum like all the fucking colors, right? So I suggest not going to college at all unless you have a full ride somewhere and you're guaranteed stuff, dude. Uh, being smart isn't getting good grades at all, dude. It's, it's literally like like this. If you don't feel good, hence, like, you have to have a good diet, you get good sleep, good. you got to be around good people, get the sun, extra, you have to do all these things in order to feel good. You're never going to feel good getting an A on a test. Like, and you shouldn't feel bad about that at all because school is literally meaningless, bro. You're literally programmed to feel bad and compare yourself to others with what test scores you get. When in reality, bro, like, I had, I had like a 2.1 GPA. I got C's and D's my whole high school career. And like now I think I'm ahead of everyone. But I mean, that doesn't matter at all. But it's like, I, I always took school like so not serious at all because I knew like it had to do with like nothing. And uh, I obviously should have probably put myself, put more effort into it and uh, go all out on the other side hustles and stuff. But even when I was in school though, I was making, and by like 10th grade, I was making websites and selling products. While, like, most people said, like, oh, don't do that. Oh, you're going to fail. This is going to happen. And it's, like, around me at my school, I didn't know anyone that did any of that stuff. So, obviously, you still got to do other things. You can't just, like, say, oh, I'm not going to go to college. I'm not going to do this. Uh, you still have to have a job, get money from scratch for most people, and then take that money, invest into a business. You're obviously you're not going to go succeed every single time. Like, it's going to take time. But highly suggest that over college any day of the week because, like, again, you don't want a job. You want to work for yourself. So it's your boy Unsquittable. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Comment for more videos you want me to make on. And other than that, have a good day and peace out.